guys and today I have a brand new video as per usual. Today's video is on Tanya Burr's new Christmas collection. Now I have purchased a few of these items and I'm so excited to show you guys what they are. As I speak they are all available on Superjug right now, you can go get them, go wild. Now there are quite a few things in the range that I did want to get, I'm still thinking about getting some of them but this video is going to be quite um, explanatory because I have the 12 days of Christmas beauty calendar. Now if you do not want to know what's in the calendar please I I tell you I'm gonna tell you this now because I do not want any of you who do not want to know what's inside the calendar to be spoiled so if you do not want to know what's in the 12 days of Christmas beauty calendar by Tanya Burr please do not continue with this video because I am going to be opening every single day and throwing this video out there so this is going to be very beneficial to those people who were like me and were a bit wary about buying the calendar. Personally I like to know what's inside the beauty calendar before I buy it but last year I was so impressed with the products that came out with Tiny Bear's calendar that I thought what the hell let's just get it this year and show you guys so you can decide whether you want the calendar for yourself or for a friend. It is £25 the calendar so it is pricey which is another reason why I wanted you to show you guys because I know quite a few of my friends wanted to know what's inside it before they purchased it. However let's just go straight into this video before any more explanation on this. Yeah. So the first thing I was definitely going to purchase in this collection, shall we say, was this little makeup palette. This is the Pretty Unstoppable Makeup Palette, makeup palette? Palette? Cosmetic palette? Whatever you want to call it, by Tanya Burr. First of all, I think I love this packaging a lot more than last year's collection, because she's kind of switched it up with this um, Christmas collection. Instead of going with that original range um, matching print. She's gone with a more Christmassy wrapping kind of print. So this is just a baby blue with these navy, navy almost grey um, spot, 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 dots all over it. And then it has Tanya Burr ribbon with this gorgeous rose gold copper label on the front. It says create stunning makeup looks on the go. So I'm going to show you guys what inside. I think with this palette you pretty much get everything from her range apart from the bronzer and the nail polish so you get a taster of her range. You get a gorgeous matte lip and this is in Martha Moo, one of my favourites of her products ever. Then you get Champagne Shimmer. I have never tried any of her highlights so this is going to be very interesting as she has released this before in her, I believe it's Peachy palette. You also get, I believe, a new blusher which is called First Kiss. It's a mauve blush shade with gold shimmer running through it. It looks stunning and I cannot wait to use it. Then we have the eyeshadows. We have Vanilla Sugar which looks to me very similar to one of the shades she has in her birthday suit. It's very similar to Champagne Shimmer I think like the um, tone and colours of it, but I think it's a little bit lighter with that satin finish. Then we have Toasted Tea Cake, which is a warm chocolatey brown, hot chocolate and cream, which looks stunning. This shade is a satin again, with kind of like a s uh, silver taupey glitter running through it, or shimmer, should we say. And then we have another matte, which is Cocoa Dust. So Toasted Tea Cake and Cocoa Dust are both matte shades. So you get in a variety, you get in your shimmer blush, your shimmer highlighter, two shimmer shades and then three matte products in this palette. And this palette is so great for value, only £9. Now if you got the full matte lip on its own it's around about £5.99, £6 and then the blush sets are £8 and then you have the eyeshadow palettes which are I believe £5 or £6 as well. So for £9 you get in a taster of her whole range and I think this is just a winner out of the whole collection in my opinion, it's just perfect, you're getting, you're getting a bit of everything and I cannot wait to use it. Next up is this gorgeous palette. This is my number one purchase from this whole range, this was a must. Again, it gives you that Christmassy wrapping paper present 
um, design and you're getting a glittery finish on this. The only problem with this is that the glitter literally comes off when you touch it or rub it so that's the only downside I have with this but I absolutely love it. You also get this kind of cute little um, real ribbon attached to it slash bookmark um, and it's just says Tanya Burr Cosmetics Beautifully Defined Palette and again it tells you on the back what is inside it. Now guys seriously this was a must for me. What is different about this is that it actually when you open it sideways the products are facing that way rather than having to turn the palette like you do with the rest of her um, palettes. It opens just like a book and oh my gosh you're getting so much product in this. So this values for £11 and in my opinion, again, this is a winner. You're getting a gorgeous liquid highlighter that Tanya Burr has never released before, ever. So it's like a brand new product to the range. You're also getting three eyeshadows, and these are just stunning. I especially love this one in the middle. This one, oh my gosh. She's never released a shade like this one. So the shade you're getting is Silk Pajamas, gorgeous rose gold shade. Cuddle Me, which is a chop like a mid-tone brown, like a tannish brown, with um, specks of like golden, like gold glitter in it. It's also coming off a bit pink, the um, glitter in that, but it just oh, it looks amazing. And then you're getting Baking Brownies, which is definitely like um, a really, really chocolatey brown, but also nearly on that scale of dark brown. Then you're getting a new bronzer which is called caramel kiss and then um the only the only kind of like thing you're going to get in both of these palettes is the highlighter the highlighter is exactly the same as the other highlighter it is the champagne shimmer in my opinion this highlighter highlighter <laughs> highlighter looks stunning now on to this bad boy oh. seriously the packaging to these things are so Stunning. I didn't really highly rate the packaging of last year's Tanya Bear calendar, but this looks stunning. Baby Blue is like really... I've, I've really been loving Baby Blue this year. I mean, I said it was just for me in the spring, um, in the beginning of the year, but I've been loving it. I mean, look, I'm wearing Baby Blue right now, and this, this, this top, guys, pound, Primark. Let's take this out of this slipcase so we can go ahead and see what's in it. I am so excited. It does tell you what products are on the back of the calendar. However, we wanna know what they look like. This calendar retails for 25 pounds, just the same as last year. By the sounds of it, what for what's in it, I think 25 pounds is a pretty good deal that you're getting, if you like Tanya Burr's products. So again, with the packaging, it's Baby Blue. Baby Blue? What's Baby Blue? It's Baby Blue and you're getting this kind of like really big house. And I'm guessing this is Tanya and that's Martha down here. Again, you're getting this glittery um, finish to it on, on some parts of it with all these cute little snowflakes, which the glitter does come off again. So be aware of that if you don't like glitter, but that's not gonna put me off it. All we really care about here is the products that are inside of it. I'm gonna be very typical here and go in number order like I would be opening it on the way to on the on the countdown to Christmas. Let's start at number one. It's right here. Ooh. Yeah, it'd be a good job, Katie, if you could open it. I'm not gonna look. But I already kind of know what it is anyway because of the shape. But we have a lip gloss. I believe it's a lip gloss, but well, I'm thinking it's a lip gloss. Day number one, you are getting a lip gloss in the shade Candy Cane. I'm gonna put this down just so I can do this like first impressions of the products for you. So it is a pink, a very, it's like a, a darkish pink, but a very vibrant pink at the same time. You have got glitter in this, silvering pink glitter in this, I would say. And just let's just swatch that. Yeah, 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 I'm loving that. Ooh, so the scent you're getting with the lip glosses, or this lip gloss, Candy Cane, is um, vanilla. Which is kind of good, because I'm kind of, I kind of didn't want it to be mint. Day number two. What are we getting? I think we're getting another lip gloss, guys. Do, you think, do we think this is another lip gloss? Day number two. It's that same shape. It's kind of good that you'd be getting lip glosses on the way down to Christmas rather than open them all at the last minute because you haven't got a chance to wear them. So let's see what's in here. So we're not getting a lip gloss. It is 
the nail file. Now, as far as I am aware, this is the only nail file we get in this calendar. Why well, I'm hoping to hope so anyway, because I don't really use. It's come out. It's out. So nail file. It's double sided. Oh, they've actually put this in a wrapper. So this is actually in a wrapper, it's not just like, you can't just use it straight away, it's actually in a wrapper, which I'm not going to open because we all know that that's a nail file, and we know what nail files do. On to day number three. Now it is this big square. Now, in my opinion, this looks like it's the only square on the calendar. So I'm thinking, if I, oh, I can't get my nails into this, I'm thinking that this is a mirror. That's what I'm thinking it is. But let's see. Let's see. I am right. It is. A, oh, it's baby blue. Loving it. Again, can't get this out. Ugh. Yeah, I much prefer this mirror to last year's. Last year's I thought was a bit naff and cheap. Again, this looks a bit naff and cheap, but not. I, I'm not. I like this. You can just put this straight into your bag, and that is actually a pretty good mirror. Ugh. Number four. Oh, this is a little cute small one. Let's see what we got. Oh, I've ripped it already. This is terrible. I'm too excited, guys. Day number four. We have another eyeshadow pot. Yes. I wonder if these. Oh my god. No, guys. Guys, guys, wait, wait. Whoa. Oh my gosh. Are you kidding me? We have a gold shimmer. I don't think we got a gold shimmer last year. So this is eye shimmer pot champagne sparkle. Mm. Yes, Tanya. Day number five. Ooh, oh, this is a long one. Another lip gloss, maybe? Let's see what we. <gasps> it's another lip gloss, and it's red. This reminds me of. Um, what does it remind me of? This one reminds me of this baby, Aphrodite. Is lip gloss in Pavlova? Pavlova? Pavlova. Berry. I'm gonna swatch Berry Pavlova next to Candy Cane. Mm. Oh, these are very opaque. That is very Pavlova, and that is in a beautiful shade of red. Day six. Oh, okay, this is a very weird shape. This is like a rectangle, a big rectangle. Oh, maybe it's a nail polish. I'm really not like showing you. <gasps> I've got gloss in my hair. That is not good. Here we go. Here we go. <sighs> No, 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 no way. That is, oh my gosh, that's gorgeous. Get out of the packaging. So last year, there was a shade called Gingerbread, I believe. And this, it was like a gingerbread was like a bronzy gold, like bronzy gold with all glitter in it, and I didn't buy it. However, this is like gold with big gold glit glitter in it. <sighs> this one is called Glitters and Gold. Yes very Christmassy. We're on day seven guys. We're getting there. It's another long one. Please don't be another nail file. Like Let's see what we've got. What is that? Ooh. 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 Yes. It's a glitter eyeliner and it's called Ice Crystals. It's not like a really like really silver eyeliner. It's it's more like a frosty white slash blue eyeliner. Tanya Burr, you sneaky little devil doing eyeliners. She needs to release these in her range if these are any good. Okay, so it's not the best applicator. It's, it's a one of those yellow brushes on the end. You might have to pack this on a bit because this is just like coming off a little bit clear. Yeah, you'd have to really like pack this on, but yeah, you can't see that silver glitter at all. So maybe not like the best eyeliner, but you could, you could build that up so it would be a little bit more opaque. Day number eight. Now, from the side, from the, the shape of it, I'm guessing, if I can open it, I'm guessing it's an eyeshadow pot, but it might not be. It's definitely an eyeshadow pot. Okay. Ooh, yeah, <laughs> yeah. We have a white shimmer, and I was actually gonna get the MAC one, but, I, need, I don't need that now, I've got this. So this is Eye Shimmer Pot in the shade Snow Day. So that makes sense, it's white with, and it's got like pink and mint, you know, mint green um, glitter in it. So it's a very nice shade. I think these shades so far are a lot more Christmassy than last year. She's really tailored it to that Christmas 
vibe this year, I think. So, yeah, I'm loving this. On to day nine, and I'm killing the snowman in the process. There's a little snowman down here, but I'm sorry. These doors don't open very well. Okay, we have another lip gloss. How many lip glosses are in here? This, again, looks very similar to what we've already got. Ah. This shade, oh, it's a matte lip. Yes! And this matte lip is called Christmas Stocking, and it is a red. Yes. I am now going to swatch that on my hand for you. It's that vanilla -y matte scent. Like, I don't know, I love that scent. I love the watermelon scent as well, but I'm going to put this to the other side. So I'm going to put it right. Yes! Loving that shade. But it's like. It's like the perfect red. It's like the, it's like really a really vibrant red. In fact, guys, it reminds me of um, Dragon Girl by Nars. Red. It's definitely a red. You cannot mistake that for any other colour. Day number ten. I'm like ripping the hole. Ooh, we have another eyeliner. Eyeliner. And this is a gold eyeliner. This is more on the bronzy side as well, guys. So this is called treasured it's just gold i like them i really like them we're gonna test this out right now again not very not very opaque however i've just noticed that the um silver eyeliner um the liquid in it is clear whereas the gold one the actual liquid in it is like an orangey brown there's the gold there's the matte red number 11 here we go Day number 11. What is it? <sighs> yes, mate. Tanya, you've done well with this. Not gonna lie. Sleigh Bells. So this one is called Sleigh Bells. Loving the names, loving the products. This is a glittery red. Day 12. The final door is another nail polish. And it's silver. It's silver and that is it that's all of the doors open the silver glitter shimmer this is very much like the gold it's got the heavy glitter in there as well whereas the red one had very fine glitter in it but this has a mix of both and this one is called glitter rain that is your 12 days of christmas i am just so glad i can use these throughout the whole of december now yeah that is the 12 days of christmas that is the end of this video that is everything if you like this video, please give it a thumbs up, please subscribe to our channel and comment below. I love you guys and I will see you guys soon. Bye! Okay, I'm going to win. I need to drink now.